Hello, and welcome back to Wormwood Institute News Network. Once again, giving you the important going-ons of our wonderful school. Before we begin, as always, let's take a moment to recite the word of Wormwood. Every time I say those glorious words, I feel ready for the day ahead. Me too, pal. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> now, we'd like to quell some of your concerns. Recently, there's been a bit of undue hysteria surrounding the disappearance of our very own Helena Ives. We're here to say that there is nothing wrong. The security team is on the case, and you can rest assured Helena will return to us safely. We understand this has been a highly distressing situation for some of you. However, if you feel it necessary, the counseling office is open 24-7. Your mom's health is very important to us. Yeah. With that out of the way, last week we discussed dropping a class without a W. But once you do that, what sort of course options are open to you? All will be revealed in this next segment. Take a look. Wormwood Institute is home to the most groundbreaking education a student can get. But what does that education consist of? Here's a bit of what you can look forward to. Principles. Immerse yourself in the world of the principal himself and absorb his key tenets of life in the principal's branch of courses. Cognition. Open your mind to originality and innovation via the cognition branch of courses. We seek to train the young mind to be mature, obedient, and superior. Communications. Well-spokenness is a trait that can get one far in this society, and it makes up the core of the communications branch of courses. We seek to develop your understanding of communicating securely and privately in a day and age where technology is advancing at a rapid pace. Syndication. Learn to build a platform for your voice by taking a class from the syndication branch of courses. Through this, you'll get the opportunity to work on the award-winning Wormwood Institute News Network, a prime example of successful syndicated media. These are just some of the class offerings at Wormwood Institute. To see a full list, be sure to visit our website. Such interesting classes these are. Which are your favorite? Oh, I don't know. This one. Have to agree with you there. You know, the students at Wormwood Institute are some of the brightest in the country. That's right, and there's no better opportunity for them to show off their talents than by joining the Student Council. Applications for Vice President, Secretary, and Treasury are now open due to their unforeseen disappearances. The President will select a winning candidate. But who's the President, you ask? Well, the Student Council presidential election is happening right now. Let's check out some of the sponsored messages from the candidates for Student Council President. My name is Anya. Today I want to talk to you about, well, you. Are you happy being at this school? Are you happy having your voice stifled by a callous administration or extinguished by the indoctrinated masses? Are you willing to push through the rest of the year and perhaps longer dealing with such atrocities? Today I say, no more. You as a student, no, we as students, cannot thrive in this environment. We cannot succeed in this environment and we cannot live in this environment. Vote for me and I will implement major changes to the campus life. I will ensure transparency and honesty from the administration on all matters, and that includes sudden student disappearances. I will ensure transparency and honesty from the student-run media platforms at Wormwood that perpetuate its selfish agenda and values. Most importantly, I will ensure transparency and honesty for myself, and I will provide updates on the various situations and seek to make Wormwood a better place. I'm just another unsatisfied student like you. Vote Anya. Changes are coming. Hi, 
You probably recognize me as one of your lovely hosts for Wormwood Institute News Network. I hope that, after the election, you'll also recognize me as your student council president. In my tenure as student council president, I plan on making some sweeping changes. Although Wormwood is a perfect school, some things still need to be addressed. In addition to those changes, I want to bolster our student pride and unity. Let's become a place where students feel as though they belong. So I ask of you, kind student, vote the host. If any of you in the audience have integrity, vote the host. Well, let's move on. For a while now, we've been planning for an important date. So don't forget that Friday is the principal's birthday. That said, we'll be having a special live broadcast to celebrate it. Attendance is mandatory, and we will be watching for absentees. This is one event you will not want to miss. Hopefully, we won't have a storm that blocks the signal. Then let's go to Keenan with the weather. Thanks, Keenan. Thanks, Thompson. Our time for this episode... Always the astute ones with your reporting. Our time for this episode is coming to a close, so let's end with the quote of the day. by any other name would not smell as sweet. Agreed. Well, that about wraps up this episode of Wormwood Institute News Network. Thank you for watching, and remember, keep, keep on, on winning. winning.